Hello everyone and welcome to my private Minecraft server. Um, I know what you're thinking, why am I doing another Minecraft video when uh, I said I wasn't doing it anymore. Uh, what can I say, I got sucked back into it and I thought I'd start another server because they're fun and I get bored of playing on my own. This is a vanilla server hosted on Mossy Cobble so we have the option to have mods although some people don't like it so I'm working on a way to have mods that don't interfere with anyone else. Did you see a creeper in there? Hmm. I might have to do something about that. Um, at the minute there's only four of us on the server. No one else is online at the minute. Um, but yeah, this is what we've got so far. The place doesn't have a name yet. Uh, the server is the server of awesome because let's face it, the four people that are on are awesome. Um, and this is spawn that I've been working on. Um, I did all this wood and the signs. I uh, didn't do any of these buildings. Uh, I'll talk about them in a minute. Uh, this is the um, mod, sorry, the op commandments. Uh, because we've got stuff like um, the ability to throw uh, exploding cats and the ability to fly. And also my favourite one. Um, only the ops can do this, and uh, the only ops are me, DJ, and um, Consort. Uh, so, right, that's uh, that. Just got the basic notice board over there. There's going to be a few rules added, but I haven't got around to doing that yet. Everything on this server is uh, legit, even community projects. Creeper explosions are turned off. Well, they're not turned off, they still damage players, they just don't damage people. Don't damage buildings, sorry. Yeah. It's been a long morning at work. Anyway, uh, first building that was built, actually, the first thing that was done was um, this. All this area was forest. Uh, but we, me and Kazort, cut it down and we started a mo oh, started a mine. Um, so that's the public mine and a little bit of a notice to players on here it's not a good idea to start a private mine in the public mine because that makes your private mine public um, I've been told a couple of people have done that so Kazort built the enchanter room now I don't know anything about enchantments so he's been teaching me uh, and I have a bow of power one um, because I play with mods I don't really need enchantments and when I get my mods back, I'll be able to have cool stuff like chainsaws and uh, stuff. Okay, uh, next is this building, which is the Potions and Brewing, built by Kazort and DJ. I went offline for about a day, came back online, and this thing appeared. Um, and, yeah, I've been told these things are iron golems. I have no idea what they are, because I don't really pay attention to, to vanilla stuff. I have no idea what you brew or what's this um, regeneration huh. um, healing fire, fire resistance speed strength that's clever looks like it's dripping into that pool I wonder if they're ever going to add that if Floor 2 is, does it say, higher potency, poison, uh, harming, weakness, so it expose your weakness or something, so his weakness is his vanity or uh, strength, speed, fire resistance, oh, oh the different what levels are the same potions, huh. fair enough. And spl splash. Isn't that a film with a mermaid in it? And oh, I can't remember. It's ages ago. 
And this reminds me of DJ's uh, bar um, in he made. Oh, snowballs. Uh, back on the first vanilla server. Um, I did think about trying to get that back, but when I loaded up the file, uh, my Minecraft died. So, and I had to reinstall everything. So, unfortunately, that world no longer exists. Well, it exists, it just can't be used in 1.2.5. Anyway. Still fly? Yes. Um, the next thing that was built is Kazort's food shop. Now this is basically a carbon copy of his one that appeared on my first server. I think the floor is different, but I've already used this a few times. Let's see. One gun powder is equals two, so one, two, three, four. Oh, no. <coughs> we do have currency on here, but we haven't really used it yet. We've also got the Stargate mod, which is quite cool. Uh, but that's to work with another mod. These are his farms, and the pigs are mixed in with the sheep, and the pigs are mixed in with the cows. So the pigs are mixed in with everything. Yes, what do you want? That's Kazot's house, which I accidentally blew up yesterday. Um, I was testing the creeper damage thing was off and I saw a creeper I thought would be a brilliant idea to test it around Kazot's house and it <clears throat> wasn't. So yes. Uh, this is Lugo's um, essentials. He still hasn't got anything in yet. You need to sort that out now. Might buy some stuff for me. Uh, and this mon that's Lugo's house. Oh, uh, sorry, kind of missed something rather obvious. This is DJ's house slash greenhouse. I don't exactly know where his house is, unless he's living in the greenhouse, but I don't see a bed or anything like that. And what would be really cool is if he automated this part of the farm. I mean, he could do the wheat and he could do the... Um, sugarcane and he could also do the cac uh, cactus but he can't do trees unfortunately um, it's really impressive and this is his summer home I believe which um, is pretty cool it's very because all DJ and Luca they're very it's nice to see the different designs I mean I haven't got really a real aesthetic mind I build things for function which I'll show you my house in a few minutes I'm not sure if I'm going to seal all that off yet. Uh, might do, might not. Uh, the city is going to be expanded this way. This is what I've been working on the last couple of days. It is the beginning of a train station. Um, yeah, it kind of worked out a little bit bigger than I thought it was going to be going to. I started building it on my single player world and it seemed okay but then I only built a quarter of it. So yeah. Uh, the trains are going to come in and there's going to be stations and they're going to go shoot off in other directions and it's going to be cool hopefully. If not it can double as a, I don't know, a warehouse or something. And this bridge I uh, myself and um, Kassort and DJ have worked on, but I think I've done most of the work. Uh, Kassort worked out the spacing of the the lights, which was a bit of a pain. I still need to finish it off. It's, it's functional. Uh, the train track works. I just need to add the rest of the stone. And uh, the server's been a bit slow today. Come on, load! And we are off to my house. I live in a jungle. Forest. Whatever. Cat. Cat. Got the cat. Got it. Yes. Oh no, it had a baby. Oh. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. Where are you? 
I need to put you out your misery. You won't survive on your own. Come back here. Where have you... Ah, there you are. Stand still. Oh! No, 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 I can't do that. Oh, why did you have to make this? Oh, it's okay, it's okay. Look, 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 look. There's a whole another family. That was like the the old weak, sick one. Phew. Ah, live in harmony with the animals. Um, yeah. Anyway, this is my house. Um, as you can see, it's a very, very epic and amazing build. I haven't been here much. Um, I'm still debating on whether I'm not to move back and destroy this place. Uh, I seem to have less chickens. I had about 20 of them yesterday. Has someone been here and killed my chickens? No, no one's been here because the sugar cane hasn't... the thing's not going. Hmm. Strange. Anyway, so, that is pretty much all the server. But the server's only been online for a couple of weeks. As I say, I haven't been on that much because um, of work. I work um, Wednesday to Sunday and have Monday and Tuesday off. Um, I spent Monday and Tuesday on the server, actually. It was pretty much all I did, apart from go out uh, with uh, a couple of friends. So, yeah, this is a server. It's um, still a work in progress, but it's coming along nicely. Things have been improved every day. And it's um, the only thing I wish I could change is the fact that we're in a snow biome because it makes it look messy. If no, we can't do the mods. I was going to say if I ever had industrial craft two on here, I would um, put a lot of terraformers around here and change the landscape to I don't know jungle or something. Anyway, so I hope you enjoyed the tour. Sorry if I waffled on a bit. And uh, yeah, thanks guys.